Justin Trudeau continues to tour the country to take questions from Canadians. However, not everyone is satisfied with the answers he gives. One Italian citizen complained to the PM about the hoops he was going through to become a Canadian. And Trudeau had this to say. You know, I'm a... 10th or 11th generation Canadian on one of my sides. I'm a, uh, but my maternal grandfather was born in Scotland, so I, I, uh, I do uh, have some idea of, of the challenges uh, it takes to come to Canada. <laughs> oh, yes. Nobody knows the struggles of an immigrant like the son of a prime minister. <laughs> Asking the prime minister a question is a huge opportunity, but then not everyone asks the best questions like this one. What happens to your neck? when you accidentally spill something on them? Not a question I was prepared for, so I have no answer for that. Um, well, it depends. Uh, sometimes a little soda water and salt uh, gets out the stain. <laughs> However, a pair of Dalhousie students knew just how to get an answer out of Justin Trudeau. They tricked him with a selfie. Take a look. Hi, can we also hey get a selfie? For sure. For sure to see you guys. Hey there. Are you planning on implementing content? Uh, absolutely, yes. Does that for mean sure. requiring Thank consent hey, for natural resource projects? Absolutely. We need, right. to, we need to engage with uh, a broad range of voices. And uh, as we've seen, uh, the Indigenous communities uh, have uh, positions on both sides of just about every different project. And those students are here with me now, Alex Aiton and Kathleen Olds. Good evening. Way to go. That's pretty awesome. Now, they say that fishing is all about the bait. You picked the perfect bait. Justin Trudeau. <laughs> cannot yeah. say no to a selfie. Yeah. Uh, when did you guys come up with the plan? Um, about five minutes before. Mm -hmm. That was it, so it was just you saw him coming like, let's screw the guy, let's get uh, it. <laughs> we knew that we had like a lot of questions to do with promises that he's broken, mm -hmm. uh, so we knew we wanted to ask him about it, but then, yeah, we found out there was a photo op, so we figured we'd crash it. And were you satisfied with the answer he gave you? Um, we won't really be satisfied until we see action on it, but we're happy he talked to us. Oh, great. Well, now, Trudeau, he made a break for it. He could not have gotten out of there quicker if he found out Obama was in the next room. Uh, look at his face. Can we see his face? Look at that face. That's very, very Scooby-Doo face. Bidet, bidet, bidet. And then your face is pure glee. Could you put that up again? Look at you. You little sadist. You're just, you love it. You're enjoying that way too much. Um, are you going to do this to other uh, politicians now? Are you going to get like a loony on a stick so you can ask Kevin O'Leary a question get him to come to you? <laughs> well, ladies, uh, thank you for this. What a great way to draw attention to indigenous issues. And if school doesn't work out for you and you want a job ambushing politicians, our door is always open. Alex and Kathleen, everybody. Catch all the latest from this season of 22 Minutes. Subscribe to CBC Comedy Now and watch.